Hey guys, welcome back to another uh, shaving with video. Shaving with video. This soap is a home run. It's not too much to ask for, right? Hey guys, welcome back to another Shaving with Rich video. And I'm excited for this video today, I'm not gonna lie. And the reason for that is I get to shave with some amazing products. When I say amazing products, this is what I'm talking about. Voskhod. If you guys watched my last video, it's my top blade. As of right now, this blade is it for me. Not to say uh, what might happen in the future with some uh, future uh, blade reviews. These are always in uh, competition. The best is always going to come out on top. Uh, so they're always competing. And that's good. That's a good thing. Competition's good. So anyways, this is what I'm excited about. I just received some amazing soap. You guys know it as CAD. Douglas Smythe sitting right there in the little uh, boat himself. In true Doug Smythe style. Good on ya. Sitting in the middle of the desert. Fantastic art, by the way. Fantastic art. I like your style. Um, in addition, we're going to be using some pre-shave. Now this is a Phoenix Ice pre-shave, mentholated. I can't wait to fill the menthol on that. It's gonna be great. It's a pre-shave. Last but not least, this is one of my favorite blades that, as I mentioned in my last video, does not get enough hype. This does not get enough attention for what a beautiful, piece of work this truly is awesome blades just awesome the detail on here nothing's overlooked this thing is fantastic so without further ado I'm gonna get this uh, shave going and you guys are gonna see just how it's gonna take down all this bird and it's gonna be great smooth shave it's a good combination. So you're welcome in advance. Anyways, before we actually get that far, I do just want to give you guys some insights on this soap. I know it's been reviewed by other people, but uh, on packaging, I give this thing on a 1 to 10 scale, I give this thing like a 12. <laughs> it's just awesome. Look at that style. That is, I mean, that's Doug Smythe style. I like it. It's original for sure. So I give it a 12 on the packaging. Open it up. Of course, you've got the uh, little plastic cover here, which is awesome. Keeps the scent built in. Razor Rock does the same thing, and I love it when people do that. Anyway, so just a little bit to add there, and here it comes. I can smell it from right here. Great scent. I'm not just saying it, but it is a full-bodied scent. Barbershop, classic. It's hard not to like this one. Anyways. Good on you. Good on you, Doug. And uh, without further ado, now I'm going to lather this thing up. See it, the performance of uh, this much anticipated shave. So we'll get to that right now. And without further ado, Phoenix Eyes pre shave. Oh, yeah. So let's get that going. All right, looking forward, looking forward. Get this rub in good. 
slick for sure in my hand even holding the whole puck and it's still slick <laughs> can't wait for that menthol to start kicking in smells good we'll compliment this uh, barbershop cad for sure Make sure I get plenty of that on here because it's awesome stuff. Feels like a winning combination. Alright, I've got enough of that on. My trouble areas are usually right here and right here. Alright, great. We'll set that aside for the time moment. Time being. Pull out the Razor Rock. With the nice lather from the CAD. And uh, let's get that working in here. Look at that lather. Are you kidding me? Dude, I just want to give a shout out to to Douglas Smythe for being such a genius with his soaps and the quality. I mean, just look at this stuff. This is a no-brainer, seriously. And uh, this is my first Phoenix uh, soap. Huge fan of the razors. Like I mentioned... You're, you're going to see me shave with one of my top favorite razors. And that's this bad boy, the Sidewinder. If any of you guys have not looked closely at the Sidewinder, you're missing out. Straight up, you are missing out. Watch this. I've got an, I have a Voscon blade in here and we're about ready to go to town. And you're about to see what this thing can do right here but yeah I did want to give a shout out to not only Douglas Smythe but all of the artists and soap makers they do a fantastic job seriously they do great work it just makes everything so much more enjoyable Doing this like nobody's business. It's plowing through this hair. Got a little bit of a weeper, but eh, no worries. Sometimes they look a lot worse than what they are. Don't even feel them. All right, first pass. First pass. All right, I will say every time that you apply new lather, you get like an extra freeze feeling sensation uh, on your face because of the menthol. It's so great. <laughs> I love that feeling. So across the grain, guys, with this monster razor here. Probably hear it just cutting. 
clean cut. It's kind of like bringing a gun to a knife fight, you know? It's going to do the trick for you. Packing pretty good with one of these razors. There's enough weight to it. Definitely has a style, so like it feels good and it, it looks good. Like it's the whole package, guys. He's got it listed on his website. Very affordable price for what you're getting. If you guys don't have uh, one of these in your collection, you're missing out. I mean, I will straight up tell you that. This is a razor to try. If you are a collector or a razor enthusiast, this is one that will be on my list and on my radar is I just I I enjoy this razor. Sometimes I wish that I could shave with it more often. And I do, but that being said, every time I do shave with it, I get great, great results. I try to keep most of my blade reviews with the, the Merc or Future because that's the one that I started with. But I may very well just make this razor my... Uh, Razor of choice for any soap reviews. Just so uh, it doesn't go very long without being used. Sometimes I miss it. Anyways, it's, just so, it's great. Nice balance of... Uh, Aggressiveness. Just about anybody could benefit from it. Because it's not too aggressive. It's not one of those super mild razors. Where you just feel like it's not efficient enough. You just have to keep going over it. And it ends up being a buffer razor. Every razor has its place. And not everybody is... Uh, at the same place with their technique and skill level so you don't want to put the wrong razor in the wrong person's hands but this razor is designed to where I think it would fit a very wide audience and that's why I just I try to promote it uh, as much as I can because a lot of people could benefit from it greatly I mean, prove me wrong. I mean, so far I'm the only one who has any review on YouTube about this razor. If you think you can prove me wrong, please do order one. Do a review of it. And uh, I don't think you'll prove me wrong. I'm quite positive of it. It'd be great to have more reviews out here because let's keep the good razors... Uh, circulating in the industry you know that's going to dictate the next level of razors they're going to obviously look at the cells and say what did people like and what people like they're going to you know they're going to put into their designs of the next generation of razors you know so we speak we vote with our dollars and uh this this razor is worthy of your vote. Like I just got a fantastic shave right now. It's fantastic. Thanks to uh, the quality of the razor. Thanks to the blade itself. I mean, the soap, the whole, the whole combination. But now here I am, just going super uh, touch up. Even though I've completed a good shave. I just have that high standard, but I met it. <laughs> Dynamite shape. I even had a lot of a lot of growth from just not being able to shave the last couple days because editing videos and work and 
and all that stuff. But you know what, guys? I just brought it to you guys. I mean, look at that stuff. Are you kidding me? Look at that. You see the sheen on that? Boom. I mean, there's so much soap. I mean, whatever kind of soap you like, how you like it thin, you like it thick, whatever you want, it's right here, man. It's like, ah. Oh. That's it. Dynamite. I'm happy with this soap. I'd rank it up with some of the top soaps that I've tried. I recommend it to anyone. That's not to say that I'm not going to continue uh, my search just like I in blades for the best blades. I'm going to keep searching for all, all the best soaps. I want to use as many as possible. Uh, Doug, I'm going to be ordering more soaps from you in the future, but I'm just totally pleased. That was great. So thank you. And uh, we'll catch you guys on the next video. Wait, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up. Do you guys see this? I mean, do you guys see this? That's what they call a BBS. Oh yeah, see you next time.